Now, great tragedy. Mantis was not in the footage we saw. So what can you tell us about the role she plays in this oh, you movie? Didn't, you didn't see? No, I didn't get a chance to see the footage. Oh, okay. So I have uh, antennas. It's cool. And they move, you know. <laughs> what does antenna, ant antenna acting entail? What? What, is, what does it mean to, to act with antennas as part of your... Uh, you know, like w when I was shooting, it was just a, a prosthetic and it was just like really short ones. And then with the CGI, they just, you know, they can like, make them move. Now, I know so... you, can't, you can't tell us much, but what can you say about her role in this movie? <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm not like really at ease like what I can say, what I can not say. Um, I'm going to help the Guardians. So what's her relationship? What does she think of Peter Quill when she meets him? Uh, she, you know, she, she spent a lot of her life, you know, on her own or not, not really interacting with uh, uh, people, human beings. And, uh, and so when she meets him, she, and she, when she meets the other gu Guardians, she's just a little bit weird, you know, a little bit. She, she tries to adapt herself and, you know, but she's like a child, you know, like a little bit like, ooh, what's, what's going on, like, you know.